Hi guys, welcome back. It's Ash from Out and About with Ash. Uh, I do short walks in interesting places. And today we're at the Yumbo Shopping Centre in Playa del Inglis in Gran Canaria. Um, so we're just gonna have a quick walk around. It's just gone three o'clock, 20 past three on a Saturday. Um, so I'm just gonna try and show you a little bit, a quick, quick little look at the Yumbo Centre during the day. Um, and it's going to be another video on the channel showing you this place at night and obviously what the difference is. Um, so yeah, let's, let's have a look. There's Leanne. So souvenir type shop, sort of creams, aftershaves. There is a lift. So if you've got any mobility issues, um, sorry, I, I, yeah, so I came up the steps. There is actually on the right hand side, there is like a, a slope and a, a ramp for wheelchair access. So if you have got any mobility issues or if you're in a scooter, you can easily get into the center and then as you walk in there's just a there's a lift just here so you you can get there's three floors three or four floors so you can easily get uh, where you want to be uh, so it's pretty accessible and it, it this place okay you sure yeah because we're overlooking eden Oh yeah, okay. But it was called Tropicana, wasn't it? So maybe that's just the sign there for saying what they do, perhaps. Mm. Meat What's from the grill. Santana Bank across here. Uh, that yeah, perfume shop there. Mm. See, down here we've got more souvenir type shops. Yeah, we were sitting just here, weren't we? So let's have, let's have a look. Yeah, if, if you want a good steak. So is it, is it, was it called Tropicana? I think, yeah, look, there we go. Uh, can you see it? Yeah. Mango man, so if you like your clothes. I've never been in a mango shop. Yeah. But I see like in Spain it seems to be there seems to be like a few of them. Like Malaga had a mango, Tenerife I think has got one. Uh, yeah, it's yeah. a Tropicana, good steak, we had a steak on a Yeah, hot can we steak. see that? Let's, let's see if I can There we go, yeah, Tropicana. And it was hot one of the stone steaks. Yeah, so hot cook, stone yeah. steak. Cook it yourself. It was really good, wasn't it? And loads of sauces. Yeah. It was, I think we got two. Like so we got two sauces each with that. It's and then, 18 euros, I think, wasn't it? Yeah. So, and with a couple of Including, drinks. Well, it, no, they were eight, on extra. Yeah, 18 euros for the steak and chips and sauces. Yeah. Like, so the whole it was nice, didn't it? the whole bill was like forty seven. Yeah, that's forty seven euros. A cocktail and a beer. So it's not. It's, it's reasonably yeah. priced, isn't it? But yeah, it was pretty good. So we had sirloins. We got two sauces each, and there's like a choice of like potatoes to go with it. You yeah. get salads. You get peppers. Um, and we went for. We didn't get gypsy sauce, which is like a tomato one, but it's something that we hadn't seen before. Um, so we might have to try that Sounds at some like point. Salsa. We said it was like tomatoes and onions. And yeah, stuff, but not so spicy. Not spicy, yeah. But we went for a, a two mushroom sauces, a uh, Bernays sauce, and I had a blue cheese. Blue cheese uh, sauce was lovely. 
Um, so yeah, Tropicana, recommend that place in the Yumbo Centre. Um, yeah, let's have a let's have a look. So this this is this is one of three main shopping centres in Playa del Inglis. You've got the Yumbo Centre, you've got the Sita Centre, and I think there's another one called the Casbah Centre, which from from watching other channels, that was uh, I think a few years ago that was probably the quite lively but from what I've seen of it recently um, obviously I haven't been there yet I might go and have a look but from what I've seen or heard of it recently um, it's not uh, it's not as good as it used to be but yeah let's let's have a look There's sun creams over here snack bar with lots of lots of cakes and stuff in there jewellery shop quick let's get 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 Leanna get, get her past these ones as quickly as possible <coughs> but yeah uh, designer brands really so Pandora Fossil uh, all of your jewellery Restaurants are on the ground floor. Yeah, how did we get where did we get the stairs from? Are they we didn't come around this far last night, no, did we? Know, I'm sure those stairs will take you down somewhere. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Let's try it. So, so yeah. You do come with a backpack, all these shops you can buy flip flops, towels. We got we got bits and pieces from the supermarket, didn't we? Like yeah. shower gel and yeah, so we've 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 travelled here. We've done like the the hand luggage challenge, or like the rucksack challenge. So book your really basic, cheapest trips if you can get it. Ryanair flight. Um, don't add on your ten kg cabin baggage. Um, go around this one. Yeah, so there's another level. Yeah. So yeah, we've we've done we've done like the hand luggage challenge. We've just got a rucksack each. No added baggage or anything like that. Um, so if you do need anything like swim shorts or towels, uh, this place has got loads of them. Um, so let, let's have a quick look. Nice clothes shop. The looks of that. It's got. It's got some brands up there, Tommy Jeans, Levi's, 40% off. So this is what happens really, I end up losing her. <laughs> we, <laughs> we come round for like a quick, a quick look. And uh, and she wanders off. Uh, I think I'll pass. Right, can we have a quick walk round through the bottom bit, and then we'll come back up. I know, but I would have wandered off, and you didn't. You might never. That could be it. You might not find me again. <laughs> Especially, yeah. Who knows? I might get captured by. The stairs. Yeah. I might get captured. But yeah, lots of cute little souvenir shops. Mm. So if you do forget anything. Well, some people find them cute. But... I so I'm. Cute. Yeah, I don't. I'm not exactly. It's. Uh, it doesn't does nothing for me 
think it is a girl thing. You can... I wouldn't call it tat, but... <laughs> I don't need, you know. I'd only, if I, only if I needed something. So yeah, lots of shops up here. There's an electronic shop up there. Uh, it doesn't look open, but all sorts of shops here. And most of the bars are on the ground floor. So let's have a look. Did we? That's Eden. So we came out of there last night. So this is where we came oh, out of okay. Oh yeah, we did, because that was the, no. I thought that was a buffet. Yeah, okay. Okay. Oh, there's the buffet. Oh, so we're just down a different set of stairs then. So Eden, uh, obviously they've got Pride event happening here. Mm, well, that's supposed to for last year, but the Pride event I think is happening here. They've got a festival on the starting on the seventh. No, starting on the 9th of March. We go home on the seventh. Um, but yeah, there's this, this, th there's a big Pride community in Grand Canaria, um, especially Playa del Inglis. And in, in this shopping centre, there's quite a few Pride or, or, or um, LBGTQ plus kind of bars. Uh, but Eden here, really good. Live singer last night. Um, drink, drinks were really reasonable priced as well. We got a cocktail and a beer for like 11 euros, nine pounds. All the cocktails are like six, seven euros. Yeah, so it's good. Yeah, you're gonna pay six, seven euros. Chinese buffet here, twelve pound fifty. There is one just just round the corner, just over there, opposite Eden, and that was ten euros um, for all you can eat. We didn't try it, but Chinatown. So really, they've got they've got steakhouses, Chinese, yeah, Italian. A couple of we saw a couple of yeah. Italians. Lots of cocktail bars. This one here last night, that was really busy. Spart Spartacus. Yeah, really busy last night. Yeah, oh, that was... And Wonder Bar. Yeah, these two were really busy. Ooh, retro night every Saturday. <laughs> yeah. Every Monday and Friday, Eurovision song contest. Oh, God. Maybe that's why it's so busy. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, as you can see, this is a like British a British pride. Yeah, it's a pride based pride based venue. Did you see that is that a men's only club? Yes. Okay, okay yeah. So, so if this, that's this is like the, the game. Yeah, corner. so this this corner is is where all of the pride stuff is going on. It was a, it was a nice You got a, a few nice up there. Atmosphere. Where was there was another bar there's somewhere, another, was it maybe up there? There's the one called like Tom Cruising. Yeah, but they're, these Tom were, you know, everyone friendly and macho, macho. Mm -hmm. I don't know, men only. Where, I going there? Where does it say that? <laughs> Basement studios, men only. Oh, uh, okay. Is welcome. Dave is. Let's look at the price list. Ten euros with a drink, Bargain. with a drink included. Right, I'll see you later. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> see, well, that's why I didn't want you to wander off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you'd never get me back. I might never know no, me. <laughs> <laughs> I might get captured. That looks like a nice hole. Then again, they'd bring me back, I'm sure, soon enough. Uh, so yeah. For wear. All yeah. yeah. So obviously during the day, not, these aren't open, but you. Fetish you've... bar. Men's I cruising bar. Last night I fetish tried to. Bar. I tried to look through the windows, but funny enough, it's all blacked out. Puppy friendly. Working dark area and bars, free lockers, puppy house. There you go. Yeah. Oh, it was like a, it was good atmosphere, wasn't it? Yeah, like, friend, yeah friendly really, atmosphere. Exactly. Um, I'd, I'll, we were just saying last night, like if if you were on your own, yeah, I'd say you wouldn't feel intimidated, no, would you? You would literally, you know, you could come out on your own chat with people and have a drink and strong construction obviously men's men's cruising bar um, yeah Show, funny boys. shows there was a drag show ah oh, this one this it one. was down here wasn't it um, 
so I've got their like named people. Oh, okay. Shay, Shay Funny Boat. Oh, are they, oh, are they the drag acts, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, so you can see. There's the, the drag artists. There's quite like there's a lot of people watching the drag show, isn't there? Like, yeah, even, so. Even people just standing out on like the street. So, oh, Rick, Ricky's Cabaret Bar. So this is, oh, okay. yeah, this is it. Yeah. So this was really, really busy last night. Burger King opposite, uh, quite so handy, could, I suppose. You could have a Burger King and then yeah. sit and watch the show. So yeah, people were sitting here yeah, they were. Um, and sitting and watching the show. Obviously there was people milling about, but you could see it. Um, but yeah, Ricky's, Ricky's cabaret show. Uh, that, was, that, was, that was really, really busy. Uh, we walked past, we watched for like a couple of minutes and yeah. it was nothing, nothing uh, like untoward or vulgar, it was. Um, no, just, just fun. Like Tom Cruising, yeah, yeah, up here. Tom so you got fiction, fiction here, Shisha she, she, she Club. Tom's Cruising Bar. Yeah, really, really nice atmosphere. Mardi Gras. Right, let's speed it up. We'll crack on rounds here. And then well, I think we where did we finish? Pr pretty much at a carry at a karaoke bar, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, so tapas bar. Zaza bar, that, that was quite busy. So it's quite good if you come out like, I don't know, whatever time you want, eight, seven, eight for dinner. Yes. And then right here, you've got all the bars and clubs and, yeah. oh, we haven't really seen that many clubs, but it's like just bars and there was, no, in that corner there was a karaoke bar. Yeah, obviously there's um, that, there's that club, but, mini casino, oh, just maybe up there. Uh, so yeah, so that corner was really, really busy. <coughs> That's kind of like the pride corner, if you like. And then you've got the arcade, like yeah. the arms, if you've got the kids. <laughs> or if you're just a big kid at heart, which I thought was quite funny. Yeah, so something for everyone, really. Okay. Go on the little car. And there's obviously, <laughs> set, what was this? There's something happening, uh, I think some it's a sort of fe festival. Sort of festival. So I don't know if it's a pride event, prob probably. But they've, yeah, they've, got, sure. they've got yeah, all yeah, of this up, up being set up in the middle. And then yeah, you come round here. So this this side was very busy last night. The karaoke. Buddy's bar. And then for some reason, the right hand side wasn't very busy. So yeah. I don't know. So this weird. this side wasn't really busy at all. Corner bar was nobody was there, but then the karaoke bar. So what's it called? Di Divinity. Yeah. Divinity. I know, I know that you you came for the pool table. They didn't. Even yeah, I walked. Like, I walked over because I found a pool table. But yeah, lots of places for like coffees and yeah, lots of places for like yeah. piano bar at the top there. Oh, huh? do Ray me party and put wood. Where? Where? You like a, you like a few sticky fingers. Oh, American okay. diner. American diner. Oh, that looks really quite cute, so, actually. Where are we? Where are we going later? Sticky fingers sticky for, fingers. Some, for something to eat. Yeah. And, and, and then. Pie and piano bar. Calm down in the piano bar. <laughs> so American diner. So that's going to be all, all like ribs and stuff. That's quite cool. Cool. And then we're. Yeah, then we're here, yeah, we're back, back to where we started. So yeah, just a quick look, not so quick look really in the end at the Yumbo Centre. Um, really cool place. As I said, shopping centre, bar, bars, restaurant, it's all in one place. It's a bit of a strange setup. I'm sort of, I'm not, I haven't really made my mind up yet whether I like it more than like a traditional strip or like a separate thing, but 
Yeah, it is quite cool. It it, yeah, it does work. So yeah, um, hopefully you found this video interesting. Um, if you have, please press like. Um, and as a, and um, yeah, please, please subscribe as well. As I said, short walks in interesting places, not just Gran Canaria. I'm going to be all over the place. Uh, it's going to be travel holiday style videos. Um, hopefully somewhere sunny. Um, so if you want to see some old favourites or maybe some new places, hit subscribe and follow us on our journey. Um, and I'll catch you on the next one.